Well, we are headed to my grandma. We're headed to my grandma's house and uh, dropping off Jasmine to hang out with her cousins, and then we're going to the store. Um, I have the newest two cousins in here with me, so just Jasmine this time. And then Nick and I are going to the store to grab some stuff so we can enjoy our early Valentine's Day. Everything on Valentine's Day gets marked up. The prices are higher. Consumerism, capitalism. So we are going to enjoy it today on the 3rd instead of on the 14th. So we're going to have a jazz-free couple hours. Not a jazz-free day, just a jazz-free couple hours. She went to my mom's house yesterday uh, from like 6 to, to midnight and uh, 7 to midnight. And now she's going to my grandma's house from probably, I'd say noon to three, maybe noon to four. But as soon as Nikki gets tired of watching them and gets worn out, I'll come and get her. I ju we just need time, honestly, to go to the store by ourselves so we can shop in peace without Jasmine being mad. She can't rip open the cookies. Um, and my grandma's got so many sweets and treats over there that she'll be good. And my grandma's like, as long as I'm not watching her, if you know, if your cousin's watching her, that's good. And my cousin, she's pregnant with her son, gonna be born next week. My other cousin just gave birth to her daughter. She was born a couple weeks ago, and I am due in 90 days. So let's count down together. And Nick's obviously got his shirt, long sleeve on, long pants, and <laughs> whatever. What is this called? A front pouch? And it's hot. So I don't, I don't know why he's dressed like that. Mampers. You know, we just left my grandma since I got some candy in my hand. Nick snagging on his three musketeer. We go into the store. Uh, Jazz is with her cuz, cousins, and I got to see my cousins and my grandma just chilling. She's uh, budgeting right now, literally looking up the prices for everything at the store and putting together a list. So kudos to her because I try to do that, but we're going on budget today. We had a good live stream yesterday. I live streamed for two hours yesterday on accident, but I still did. There was like a glitch in the email. I couldn't see the triggers until the last half of the live. So I got like 30 triggers. And um, we're gonna, we're going back and forth about what we wanna get, but this is supposed to be a Valentine's Day theme dinner, lunch. We're gonna like those boys, you know? Just the sleeves. Just take off the shirt real quick and switch them out, bro. Nobody's looking at you. We've made it to the store. We're about to go in, get some stuff. We're out of sugar at the house, and we're out of syrup, and we're out of honey. So we're going to get those things first, and then just get some stuff to just enjoy the day. I don't know what we're going to get yet. It's kind of just play by ear. Um, but also, we might get gas, too. Even though the car's on half a tank, if we're just like, we're here, so might as well. Um, but yeah, I got to get the keys out the car. Hey. Might as well just leave it in the car. <laughs> it looks stupid. Because the breeze is blowing super good, so it's like. I told you it was gonna be blowing super good. I said smoke in the jacket and then take the jacket off. You're right. You're always right. <laughs> yeah. We are in the store. Maybe Nick will get me some flowers. But uh, yeah, gray is my color, so I look super good, but Nick had to go outside and grab a cart, so I'm waiting on him right now, and I'm near the self-checkout. People are eyeballing me because I'm filming, but I don't care. I got a vlog for y'all, show y'all what I do. There he is. Two things already not on the list, and then Nick is looking at the sushi. Shocker. Ugh. Look healthy vegan bites. I mean, we did like the sugar cookies last time, but chocolate dipped macaroons. Madeline's. These are pound cakes. Unless you want to get like a cake from the bakery. All right, we can go look. This one, the 
six inch white cake with buttercream. White chocolate as a topping versus white chocolate alone. It's like this is a chocolate Oreo cake. I know for a fact these cakes are good because um, when I worked at the party store, people would bring this one all the time and they would offer a slice. So I would do this one or I would do a cupcake situation. We got some cakes. So we're fatties. Yeah. The pie fillings. Thank you. I'm turning towards you because you know it's apple pie though. Pie. Why are you hating on apple pie? This is Texas. This is America. Apple pie is a staple. Yeah. How many muffin holders is that? 50. 50. That's pretty good. As long as it's Hill Country. Original Hill Country's down there. Butter rich. Yeah. Anything with sugar free. Anything with sugar free is crazy. <laughs> Cereals. I'll go for the classic. These remind me of my granny. She always had those at her house. Like the only good cereal option other than Frosted Flakes. Jasmine's been wearing out the banana pudding. Yeah, when she's not working with her first. Yeah, true. When she wants to be good. I know what I'd get. I would get wedding cake or caramel. Yeah, I wish I was married to somebody who cared about me. Aww. We're gonna go home and get our eat on. Right. I love how no matter what I do, you're always ungrateful. Like, you always have to say something. Like, might as well just stick to the budget and not get anything out of pocket. Time to check out, Pickles. Just waiting on the cashier, and then we are out of here. Wordplay. This isn't even our normal HEB. And they didn't even have the freaking cans that we wanted or the carton size things that we wanted. Oh, he's bagging and he's cashing. Ching.
Thank you. All good. We are done with our shopping trip, headed home. Spent $133, but it's long-term stuff. That's how I, that's what I say to justify it, spending so much money. <laughs> and we got a lot of stuff we didn't need, like a bunch of sweets and treats and stuff. I mean, it is for Valentine's Day, but like we still get stuck to like a $50 budget. But then there was a couple things that we needed just aside from Valentine's Day. So it's okay. Happy Valentine's Day, Thickums. So we are back in the car. We decided on like a little bit of an Asian themed um, Valentine's Day with cheesecake, an actual like celebration, birthday, anniversary cake sort of situation and um, ice cream. So that's what we decided to do. I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna turn on the fryer and then throw in the uh, spring rolls. And after those get cooked, we'll have the sushi with it. And then after that, we'll have uh, ice cream and cake and stuff. So that's very exciting. Nick put everything in the car. He said he didn't want me to lift anything and to just sit down in the car. So here I am. And I checked my phone and my cousin texts me, your daughter's crying, she won't stop crying. What do I do? She keeps crying, she's missing y'all. She's looking for y'all. And then five minutes later, she's like, I got her to calm down by putting on TV, um, telling her we don't do that crying thing over here. And I'm like, good, just, you know, tell her what the what is what, and then she'll chill out, you know what I'm saying? Like, push come to shove like a FaceTime or let her know, you know, hey, baby, we're fine, you're fine. But this is the first time she's been at my grandma's house for like a long period of time without us. So I feel like that's what really got her. It's just her first time over there without us. Usually we stay and kind of supervise the visit, so... Now that they're about to be three, all the toddlers, it's like, you can do this on your own. This is you time, hangout time. And I told my cousin, I was like, I'll take your baby if you want, you know what I'm saying? Your two year old and just vibe. Because we got a big backyard. We could put them in Jasmine's room for a sleepover or we can take them somewhere to like the park down the street. So I wasn't pressed either way. Nick's old Knox about to get some music on before we drive home. And he's like, he's like, I can't eat, I'm so hungry, I haven't eaten breakfast all morning. Meanwhile, I haven't either. And I'm like, I know, because we woke up, took Jasmine to the grandma's, and then we're here at the store now, but we're gonna eat soon. He's like, yeah, but I still gotta drive home. The house is five minutes away, this dude. Then he's like, it's okay, baby. I thank you for getting the stuff, I appreciate you. It's like, yeah, yeah, fix your tongue. <laughs> <coughs> Just taking a moment to clean out the car, pulled out all the trash. And now I am going to vacuum up these crumbs in the back and wipe out these seats. Got everything I need right here. We actually left my wallet at the HEB, so we had to go back and get my wallet. I found it. It was in the cart that Nick put away. He apparently didn't see it in the cart, but we got, we got it back. No problem, but we're just cleaning up the car. Took a bit of time. Got everything tidied up. It's not perfect, but it's definitely better than... Uh, it was before and uh, happy that I was able to clean out these seats a little bit and make this floor black instead of freaking dirty dirt 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 gotta put this stuff away now finally done ripping and running around pickles and we got our Asian themed Valentine's Day watching guys grocery games good stuff Well, our tummies are full and our hearts are satisfied. Pickles, we are just gonna be relaxing for now. Jasmine is gonna be at my grandma's house for probably like two more hours. And then I'm gonna bring my cousin some of the cake that I bought because she's watching Jasmine. So I'm pretty much just saying thank you with the cake and she's pregnant too, so I know she will want it. Pregnant girls unite. <laughs> but um, yeah, we got everything uh, eaten up. It was pretty good. Uh, we still have a little bit more sushi in the fridge. I believe one more pack or whatever. But the uh, spring rolls were really tasty. And our Asian cuisine is done. And we also had the cake, cheesecake, ice cream combo as a sweetener. Now we're just watching people cook. And it's good because we don't have to like crave the stuff that they're making because we already ate. So it's good to just relax, unwind. And we also got the car cleaned out. So the car looks really good right now. And like I'm excited to get back in it and go pick up Jasmine just to like ride in a clean car for once. For the first time in four years, three years. Whoa, I used to keep my car clean and then I had kids. Okay, kids, we've only had Jasmine. <laughs> okay.